once they hear everyone celebrate together and eat, but those children, ana yatim, stay alone and they eat without father or without mother, both killed in the last war. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Saya Dr. Ziad Shihada, Hungaros Pesar Vijabat Gaza. Thank you for watching this episode of Capsule Ramadan and inshallah uh, we hope you enjoy all our uh, episodes. Today uh, I'm going to talk about the obstacles that face the Muslims in Gaza during Ramadan. As you know, Ramadan is a special month. So everyone need to enjoy the time, have to celebrate, but we have so many problems in Gaza. You can imagine if you gather the family in one place and you start eating iftar without father. If the father already become shaheed or the father in the Israeli prisoner. So absolutely all the children feel very sad during this moment. Once they hear everyone celebrate together and eat, but those children stay alone and they eat without father or without mother, both killed in the last war. So we sometimes in my care go and try to celebrate or to have makanan with them during the, the iftar time. We have also uh, the most important thing that we are facing is the iftar time. Because every family need to have a delicious food during the iftar all the time, all the day fasting. And the last moment, they don't have something to eat. So we are trying as my care to provide them to cover their need. The, the children before uh, the last uh, days of Ramadan and before Hari Raya, they need uh, clothes to wear. This is a culture in Palestine. Most of the Palestinian children have to buy a new clothes, especially in Hari Raya Eid al-Fitri. They, they just go and celebrate in the street with a new clothes. But those poor families, the children of them, go outside in the street, see everyone with the new clothes, start crying, feel very sad. So we are trying to change their life. During Eid also, in Eid al-Fitr especially, we as Palestinians give the children do it raya. We give them. But for the, those uh, poor children, who will give them? All the community or all this area, very poor area. Who will give them the do it raya? They will feel sad. We are trying all the time to give them love, to give them a hug, to give them also money to celebrate. So this is what happened in Gaza and need assistance from all Muslims to, uh, to cover the needs and to compensate the loss of the father or mother or both. Thank you for watching this episode and see you next episode. Insha'Allah ta'ala. Salamat barabuka buasa. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.